Hello friends and welcome to my channel. In this video we'll make a very simple linear power supply with LT1083. So let's begin. Here we have all the parts. You will find the link in the description with schematic and PCB. Looks very very simple. All the parts, the value is uh, written on the PCB. So it's a bridge rectifier, capacitor for filtering, and this power supply IC. This is specialized. Now let's begin. I put uh, everything together, as you can see all the parts are soldered. soldered. It was a small problem, this resistor was not uh, 5 kilo as it should, it's uh, 5 mega. And I replaced this uh, resistor. And now uh, let's make some tests. I have to tell you this yellow part is a resetable fuse, actually it's some kind of PTC, positive temperature coefficient, and uh, when uh, this current is uh, increasing in this part, the his uh, resistance is increasing also and that's why it's a very very simple uh, fuse when uh, you have a big current it's heating and it's interrupting the circuit and after this it's uh, cold it's a good fuse again I tested this, but I don't know this parameter. If uh, to check where what is the current, this uh, function. No, everything is uh, put here. I connected this uh, small transformer. It's uh, 14 volts and uh, 2 amps between 1 and 2 amps I made this uh, device this uh, show us voltage and current through this and this is a dummy load if you want you can see the video about I made an entire video how I made this dummy load but first of all let's test first of all let's test without load This is the maximum voltage. Now let's measure alternative voltage. It's here 40 volts alternative and uh, 70 volts on the output. and uh, 
after uh, bridge rectifier it's also 70 18 volts now let's put the voltage to the minimum and let's put the load We have 4 volts and 3 amps, still the minimum. If we increase the voltage, we can see the voltage, it, it should be 12 volts, but it's only 5 volts on 3 amps. The diodes are beginning to be hot. Now let's measure the voltage on transformer to see if the transformer is too small current. Voltage on transformer is 8 volts. On 8 volts, alternative current, it should give us uh, 12 volts continuous current. Now let's measure the voltage on the rec on the capacitor uh, after bridge rectifier. And here I add some alternative. I have to put it on continuous. There's only six volts. Now these uh, diodes are uh, very very hot and it's uh, very simple to see that on these diodes they should have 10 amps but uh, only on 3 amps there is a big uh, drop of, of voltage on them. Let's measure the drop of voltage. There is 3 volts drop of voltage on every diode. This uh, means 6 volts uh, drop of voltage. With 6 volts there is exactly 12 volts that should be. If the transformer has a too small current then uh, the voltage here would be very very low but the voltage on the output of the transformer is not very low that means that uh, i have to replace these diodes with other other diodes that uh, they can take 3 amps now let's make other tests. We'll take this uh, transformer out and uh, to check this uh, IC stabilizer we'll use this uh, power supply exactly after the bridge rectifier practically will jump over these diodes this is minus 
this is plus now I want to check this IC if it's good or not let's disconnect the transformer now let's make some tests we'll replace this load with this dummy load let's Tw 24 volts uh, continuous current but uh, you can see there is fluctuation on current and power I think because this IC let's what I want to show you if we put here uh, 30 volts something uh, it's not good because this shows 0 0.5 amps and this shows 3 amps something is not good let's make smaller voltage and also we have fluctuation here we don't have a fluctuation only there now the dials are cold because they are not working And uh, what I didn't like is that this potentiometer should go from zero to maximum voltage. And as you can see on the minimum position, still we have uh, 5 volts on the output. I am a little disappointed by this uh, stabilizer IC. Now let's make other tests. I put this uh, 8 ohms dummy load voltage from power supply is 30 volts here is on minimum voltage as you can see there are 5 volts on output if I increase the voltage from here output voltage doesn't uh, grow above uh, 5 volts and that's because this uh, IC oh, it's hot works only until uh, only with uh, input voltage under 25 volts if I decrease the voltage here twenty volts now uh, you can see this uh, starts 
on maximum voltage we have 18 volts one volt only one volt drop of voltage and now it's working good but if i increase uh, input voltage uh, above uh, 25 volts this will not work that's what i wanted to show you now let's test again minimum voltage here as you can see it doesn't start there are only 5 volts on output now my conclusions is uh, let's my conclusions are that i don't uh, really like this module and uh, i don't know if i can find uh, some purpose for this if you tested a module like this please uh, write a comment and tell us your conclusions i hope that you liked this video please like and subscribe see you in my next video bye